I don't know. I just feel as a, as a straight man, if you're able to accept your sexuality, like, yeah, you, you might not be 100% comfortable ever with gay men and how they express themselves, but it's really none of your business. That's how I feel. It's really none of your business. Um, just do you, man. Focus on you. And if you don't want your child growing up to be something like possibly gay, male or female, then you might be too worried about the wrong thing. All right, so look, we all know this video right here. Uh, I'm not sure about the song because I ain't really heard the song, but this video we know got heavy backlash, you know, and then you got one side, you know, well, if y'all don't like this, y'all, you know, because WAP is okay with Cardi B and uh, who was that? Megan Thee Stallion, that's okay. You know, so you got two sides. You have some people who run with what society says is okay and not okay, which is women can get away with certain things. Men can't and men can get away with certain things. Women can't. And then you have those who just feel how they feel about what they feel about. You get what I'm saying? Me, I'm on my business. I stay out the way and um, I try to look past certain things, but uh, Lil Nas, Jack Harlow industry, baby, uh, they're going to drop. I mean, Lil Nas X is dropping his album on tarot tonight. I might live stream and react to it. Let me know if y'all want that. Um, but um, yeah, we finna get into it. I don't know what to expect. Of course, I've seen the clips here and there like everybody else, but I've never watched this video uh, nor heard the song. So this is okay. Lil Nas X, I sentenced you to five years in Montero State Prison. <laughs> This shit wild, but I guess they saying, you see how I say three months after he went to prison. So I guess the stereotype prison turns straight men out and just the whole, let me say this, say what y'all want, but Lil Nas X, his team, whoever is a marketing genius watch how watch the type of numbers his album does and watch the reaction he that he gets oh, like the, they know what they're doing man you can't be mad at it like I, I'm, I watch stuff and I see stuff like this and I learn from what they do to you know pivot you know my career or the things I'm trying to give to the world which is like spirituality meditation and positive vibes you feel me Throw it back, hey. and this one is for the champion. This the part. <laughs> this part had people hot, bro, and it's like y'all gotta understand, like the LGBTQ. Then they added extra letters. It's like it's a real lifestyle. It's a real thing, and y'all gotta understand. Some kids grow up um, feeling different. You know, some young boys grow up not feeling like boys. They feel like they're supposed to be, and women, you know, young girls grow up feeling like they're supposed to be boys. And like, who are we to really judge and criticize who? they are what they decide to do i think people argument is like it's so pushed in our face like look at this you have naked men in the shower twerking and but i hate to be i hate to be the one but we enjoy whopped and i'm a straight man don't get it you know twisted i'm not this is really not a biased opinion because <sighs> It's gonna go over your head. It's gonna go over your head. And look, do y'all think? Do y'all think all of them men are like, you know, homo? Or you think some of them just got that check? They straight men, got a wife at home with kids, and just did that scene. I like, keep it real. I'm, I'm sure not all of these men are gay. You know what I'm saying? I guess there's some men are just that comfortable with their sexuality to where it don't bother them. You know, it's just interesting to know how many straight men are in this video. Even Jack Harlow. I don't think he's, he's almost. You was never really rooting for me anyway. When I'm back up at the top, I want to hear you say, you don't run from nothing, dog. Get your soul. So I'm trying to catch the lyrics. So it seemed like. 
And like when you be your true self, you're exposed to the world, who you really are, what you really believe in. You're going to get judged and criticized. You're going to lose fans, support his family might disown you. And he's just saying like, y'all wasn't messing with me anyway. You know, um, so once y'all see, once people accept me for who I am, when I'm back thriving and at the top, I don't stay, keep that, that, that them facts and them opinions and your judgment of me, you know? Need me like one with Nicky now. Tell a rap nigga I don't see it. Huh. I'm a pop nigga like Beaver. Huh. I don't fuck bitches, I'm queer. Huh. But these nigga bitches let me. It's a good song. The song is cool. It's a good song. You know, a lot of people just felt the way about the video, I guess. Which I understand both arguments. You know, but again, we have gun violence, rappers talking about drugging women, uh, women talking about drugging men and stealing their wallets and money and watches. So. A lot of this people do and say online, they're very contradictive and I have very biased opinions because they may be against homosexuality or they may be against thugs or they may be against women being comfortable showing their body off. So you, you got a lot of wishy-washy stuff on the internet. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, oh, let do it. I ain't fall off, I just ain't release my new shit. I blew up, man, everybody trying to sue me. You call me Nas, but the hood call me Doobie. And this one is for the champion. You about to escape that motherfucker. Like this is his nails painted white too. Like we can't like we can't deny true talent and we have to separate the artist from the art. You know, like and I think it's hard for straight men to accept that it's gay men in this world. Like it and it's crazy like how the world, even myself, like you know, two women together is like, oh, that's like, and I, I guess because I'm attracted to women and not men, but it's still like, that's more accepted than the other side. And that's crazy. And a security guard too. Look, no cap. I did a reaction to that Montero song and that's a whole nother story. I mean, the video I actually reacted to Lil Nas X fans, they came for me like a mug. But that's a whole nother story. My track record so clean, they couldn't wait to just bash me. I must be getting too flashy. Y'all shouldn't have let the world gas me. It's too late because I'm. So, is he like making a point like, hey, I'm in this video, but I'm straight? Like, is that why he did that? I'm here to stay and these girls know that I'm nasty. I sent her back to her boyfriend with my handprint on her ass cheek. You know what I be loving? When the lyrics match with the video, that's so dope to me. City talking, we taking notes. Tell them all to keep making posts. Wish he could, but he can't get close. OG so proud of me that he choking up while he making toast. I'm the type that you can't control. Said I would, then I made it so. Oh. I don't clear up rumors. Hey. Where's y'all sense of humor? Hey. I'm done. He's breaking everybody out and then. So they oh i get it it's like they reversing the roles to where being straight is a crime how people treat being gay is a crime oh see y'all gotta y'all gotta y'all gotta catch the messages in these songs man. i'm making jokes because they got old like baby boomers turn my haters to consumers i make vets feel like they juniors say your time is coming soon but just like oklahoma Mine is coming sooner. I'm just a late bloomer. I didn't peak in high school. I'm still out here getting cuter. All these social networks and computers got these pussies walking around like they ain't losers. So did I get that right? The message behind it, the, the video? Like, did I get that? Did I nail that or am I wrong? I 
that's just for this video. Um, I hope they don't block this shit. You know, YouTube would be tripping. But um, I don't know. I just feel as a, as a straight man, if you're able to accept your sexuality, like yeah, you you might not be a hundred percent comfortable ever with gay men and how they express themselves, but it's really none of your business. That's how I feel. It's really none of your business. Um, just do you, man. Focus on you. And if you don't want your child growing up to be something like possibly gay, male or female, then you might be too worried about the wrong thing. You get what I'm saying? You, you're probably too worried about the wrong thing for real. But, um, yeah, that's it for this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. If you're new, hit that notification bell. Uh, I'm going to catch you on the next video, man. Montero tonight, man. I might check it out with y'all. Yeah.